Hello everyone in YouTube land. We love our sound back. Crazy ass videos. Official page. Epic Mickey unboxing. Yes. Or Disney Epic Mickey. I call it Epic Mickey for short, but it doesn't really matter. Finally picked it up. Got, finally got around to it. A deal at Best Buy. $34.99. Actually $37 with tax, but um, I was going to get it a while ago when it first came out. I don't remember when it came out. November, December, but uh, I was turned off by the reviews. Everyone is giving it a hard time because of the whole camera controls and everything. And I wanted to get it. Finally, I had played the Truth's copy when he brought it over. And I really loved it. It's an amazing game. I would definitely give it a 9. So it's an amazing game. I can't wait to play this. And this is my first Disney game. Uh, I love platformers. Um, I heard uh, Warren Spector uh, and Junction Point. Like, obviously, Warren Spector made the game. And there's a lot of... Uh, a lot of Zelda stuff in this game. If you're a fan of Zelda or obviously Mario or any platformer for that matter, definitely pick this up. If you're a fan of Disney or Pixar, even if it, uh, obviously they don't have any Pixar references in this game. It's mostly old school Disney obscure characters and whatever. I, I just can't wait to try this game and whatever. I'm not going to make this video too long. So let's get the unboxing. Um, but yeah, I, and this is a very, very reason, ugh, can't even talk here. The very reason why I don't have a 3DS. I buy games. I buy Wii games. And I'm trying to uh, get caught up on all the games here and everything. And only two games I need to get from when it came out in November, I think, was Wii Party and Fling Smash, I think. So even though if, if, we, if I get Wii Party in from the Nintendo, that package deal, that gift thing, I don't have to buy it. So I'm glad I'm getting caught up now. I mean, this is how many games that came out in 2010. I'm still buying games. Like I bought Monster Hunter Try a couple weeks ago and obviously the Blob 2. That got, I got, got that on the first day, so... But here, does he, oh, I don't like that disc art. That's kind of weird. I wish it was kind of like that, you know, have all that on there. But I guess didn't have any room to put Mickey or Oswald on there. So, um, pamphlet, save tent, what the heck is this? Coupon, eh, fuck, all these games suck. Disney Channel All-Star Party, Cars 10, ugh, Cars Tune Makers, Guilty Party, Tangled, Sing It, screw that. Yeah, it's a coupon. I don't know, I'll probably give it to my nephews or whatever, who cares. Uh, but yeah, I don't like that disc cart. It's kind of weird. It has, it's typical, kind of generic, but I like it. I don't know. Let's see if the manual's even better. Probably not. I'm not going to go through the manual because you already did in the Truths video, so. Yeah, nothing really special. I mean, I can figure out the controls by myself. Don't need the manual. But yeah, I can't wait to try this. I might do gameplay videos, so. Yeah, if you haven't picked this, if you guys haven't picked this game up, go to, go to Best Buy. The deal will end. And I checked around GameStop, GameStop and Target. They're $50 new. It's 50 bucks. Go to Best Buy, $34. Well, actually, uh, 37 with tax, but who cares? You save like $10 or whatever, you know? You'll save money on it instead of getting it new or even used somewhere. So, um, but yeah, this is my Epic Mickey unbox uh, my Epic Mickey unboxing. Sorry if it was too quick and too short. I just want to, like, just want to try it out. So, um, yeah, I might do gameplay videos. I don't know yet. So, yeah, pick this up. So, yeah, later. Bye.